this sneaker is a problem out of nowhere. What is going on? Ring on the finger. I got married. I am so happy. I got married last Friday. That's why I haven't been uploading. Wow, I'm married. I'm a married man. Married life. It's crazy. Thank you guys so much for congratulating me on Instagram, DMing me. I got a ton, a ton of DMs. Thank you guys so much for the love and the support. I'm a married man. Please take a second to smash that like button. Hitting that thumbs up really helps the channel grow. Also, make sure you guys smash that subscribe button if you guys love sneakers and free sneaker giveaways. I have a giveaway going on I'll tell you guys about in a little bit. Make sure you guys subscribe. Stay tuned. Let's get into this fire. Straight fire video. I'm giving away a free pair of the Reverse Mocha Travis Scott Jordan 1 Lows. All you guys need to do is like this video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment. Let me know your size. For a bonus entry, you guys can follow me over on Instagram, dannymore2369, and DM me proof that you did everything. Good luck. This bag is my favorite bag because it holds my sneakers safe and secure when I'm traveling. Check that out. I got my Jordan 4s, my Jordan 1s, my laptop, and a ton of other space inside of this bag. And this is just the daily bag. So Premise also makes a bigger backpack that holds five to six pairs of sneakers, duffel bags, luggage carry-on bags. They also make stroller bags, all different types of bags, all TSA approved, which means you can take them with you on the airplane. And all of their bags are designed to hold your sneakers when you're traveling safe, secure, bring in all your sneakers with you, as many pairs as you want, and bring them safe and secure. Travel the right way with Soul Premise. Make sure you guys click that link down below in the description. Use my code Danny Moore. My name Danny Moore at checkout will give you 40% off your entire order, which is a lot of money off. So make sure you guys click that link and check out Soul Premise. Thank you, Soul Premise, for sponsoring this video. This sneaker has become an unexpected problem almost out of nowhere. The prices have actually gone up very quickly. I did call that this was gonna happen. I did think it would happen rather quickly. Right before the drop, they were going for around 250, 260, 270 in the bigger sizes. They're over, well over $300 now. Bigger sizes at like 350, smaller sizes still at around $300. On release day, Nike sneakers app actually wind up pushing back the drop a few minutes before it was supposed to happen. They wind up pushing it to October 5th on a Wednesday, which means less pairs were actually put out there on the market on release day. We saw a nice big, big jump on release day, and after the sneakers drop now, they're still over $300. This is crazy because it hasn't been happening pretty much most of this year. A lot of these releases have been either sitting going under retail or staying slightly above retail, not having a big price increase quick. Well, this sneaker is the exception. This sneaker has become an unexpected problem pretty much out of nowhere. The Air Jordan 4 black canvas. What is going on with the price, with the market? What happened? The black canvas 4s remind you, of course, of the Eminem Carhartt Jordan 4 that is reselling for crazy, crazy money, $30,000, $40,000. This right here is the alternative, the best looking alternative. Very, very similar colorway wise. Materials are off and different. Details are not the same, of course, but when you actually look at the shoe, it's very similar. And people want these. They're eating them up left and right. People want these sneakers. They're copying, they're buying nonstop. And the demand is through the roof, which caused the resale price to go up quick. Do I think that these are going to remain above 300 in the bigger sizes? Probably. Smaller sizes, we may see a little dip to high 200s and they will go back up to over $300 in the smaller sizes. Bigger sizes still going to be over, over 300 and I, they will go up to $400. This is a really good investment. This is a clean wearable sneaker and the canvas is not cheap, it's not crappy, it's thick, and it's really nice in hand. If you haven't seen them in hand, I highly recommend getting them in hand. I think it'll change your opinion on this Air Jordan 4. This price increase, quick price increase, shows that, hey, first of all, the sneaker market's not dead. 
It's not dead at all. It just has to be certain sneakers. But going back to 2018, 2019, years ago, when only certain things would have this hype, this resell, this demand for it, and that's what's going on with the Black Canvas Jordan 4. If you want a personal, go ahead and cop. I would say wait a few days and cop. Let people get pairs in from the sneakers app and then go ahead and cop because the demand is simply there. The demand is there for the Black Canvas Air Jordan 4 and it's gonna remain there. This is gonna be a very sought after sneaker in three, four, five years from now. People are gonna look back on the Black Canvas and regret not copying them for around 300 bucks when they're gonna be four, $500 sneakers. The fact that the Black Canvas 4s looks like, of course, the M&Ms, they also look like the Bread 4 without the red hits. They remind you a lot of the Black Cat 4s that are eight, $900. Of course, people are going to wear these because of the colorway, the wearability factor is honestly through the roof. And when you wear your Jordan 4s, I highly recommend putting on drip grip sole protectors to preserve the bottom, keep the bottom fresh, keep it in good condition. So when you peel off the drip grip sole protector, it'll keep the bottom looking brand new. As you guys can see, I have drip grip sole protectors on my off-white Nike Dunks. So when I peel off this sole protector, that bottom is gonna look brand spanking new, keeping the sneaker in great condition, and I'll be able to resell them one day for more money with no flaws on the bottoms. Link for Drip Grip and my code Danny10 down below in the description. Make sure you guys check out Drip Grip, the best sole protectors on the market. When you're wearing your sneakers, you wanna keep them in great condition, and Drip Grip is the best way to do it. Link down below, check them out. I want you to leave a comment. Let me know if the Black Canvas 4 was a problem for you. Were you having a hard time? Did you have a hard time copying them for retail? Did you take an L? Did you take a W? Let me know, leave a comment down below. Also, let me know, will you be selling your pairs, holding on to them, wearing them? I think the Black Canvas 4s will be on a lot of people's top 10 list of the entire year, especially when it comes to wearability. This sneaker is so wearable, so clean, and gonna cause a major problem now, but especially in the future, but right now, unexpected. I think a lot of people were not expecting these to shoot up in price like they have. And I told you guys, I had a feeling they would. Buy the Jordan 4 Black Canvas now, before it's too late, before you regret it, because the Black Canvas 4 became an unexpected problem, pretty much out of nowhere. These became a problem. This is crazy. Market went up quick. Leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys join the Moore family. Hit that subscribe button. Smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop. Always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out.